my name is Shivy Williams. I am your health, wellness, and fitness accountability coach. And I'd like to welcome you to day seven of this 30-day challenge. Woo! Can you believe it? We are one a week into this challenge. I want to say y'all are doing great. Great job. Um, y'all are not coming up with excuses. I'm so excited to see everybody still participating. And we're rocking out 2016 strong, doing our arm and butt and gut challenge. What a great way to end the year out, right? And we're doing it together. I'm excited. So we are going to go ahead and get started. If this is your first time joining me, welcome. You can play catch up. All of the videos are on my YouTube channel at LBX Fitness. So go there, catch up. There's a link in the post um, to my YouTube channel as well. Now, let's get started. Today, we are doing the arm and butt, arm and butt, the arm challenge and the butt and gut challenge. For the arm challenge today, we are adding in another exercise. I hope y'all are ready for this. So, you are going to need a chair, or you can use the wall, or you can use your knees, or you can be on your hands. Actually, not your knees, sorry, and not the chair, and not the wall. I just thought about what we were doing. None of those things. So anyway, we are adding in what's called a half cobra push-up um, to the arm challenge. So get ready. Let's go ahead and get started. We are going to start first with the arm challenge. I'm going to grab my weights. I'm going to do what I've been doing, and I'm going to go ahead and go on my knees. You can stand or you can go on your knees. It's up to you. I am using two-pound weights. You do not have to use weights if you don't want to. You can also use water bottles. They are really good um, weights as well, and they will work. So today, we are going to go ahead and do 15 arm circles first. So everybody's arms are out. We're going forward. Let's start. And one, two, this is three, four. You'll see that we're not going fast. That's six and seven. Abs are tight and you're breathing. 10, 11. We're going to feel these. 12, 13. Don't go fast. 14, 15. We really want to work our muscles really good. So now, palms are facing out. We're doing our shoulder raises, our arm raises. Let's get started. 15 of these. Up. Breathe out. That's one. Come down. Up. Two. Your abs are tight the entire time. When you go up, you breathe out, okay? And then breathe in, going down. Here we go. Four. Abs tight. And five, you want to squeeze your shoulders at the top. And six, the more you squeeze, the more you're going to feel this, right? And seven, let's go. I always want you to do what you can when doing these workouts, okay? So it's okay if you do not, if you're not able to do all of the um, reps that we're doing. This is ten. Just do your best, okay? 11. If you need to take a break, that's fine. And jump back in. 12. We have three more to do. Three. Make sure you're breathing back is straight. Two. Woo, feeling this in my shoulders. And last one. Great job, everyone. Now, the last one of these to do with the weights is our, I like to kind of call these chest press. So we're taking our arms up here, kind of like right in front of your hands, your face in front of your hands. You don't have to have weights for this part either. And we're taking our elbows and bringing them close together. So let's go, we're doing 15, go. One, you're breathing out when your elbows touch. If you can't get your elbows to touch, that's okay. Just bring them as close as possible. This is six, seven, eight, abs tight, nine. Do you feel these? I feel them. Eleven, twelve, whew, thirteen. Our shoulders 
are going to be looking good. And last one. Great job, everyone. Putting the weights down. Now we're going to go ahead and do our half cobra push-ups. So here's the position for the half cobra push-up. You're down like this in cobra position. This is a yoga move. Okay. So here we are in cobra. And we're just bending our elbows like this and doing a push-up. Easy, right? Let's do as many as you can. We're doing five of them today. So let's go ahead. Look straight ahead. Go down. Come up. That's one. Abs are always tight. Two. And down. Three. If this bothers your back, go up on your knees some. And then go as low as you can. And this is the last one. Great job, everyone. Now, it is time for us to do our um, gut and butt. And while we're here, we're going to go ahead and do this in reverse order. We're doing plank and lunges today. We're doing 40-second plank, and we're doing 15 lunges. So let's do our plank first. Plank can be done um, with a chair, on your knees, um, on your toes on your elbows, on your hands, right? So that's a lot. So I'll show you a couple different ways. I always like to start on my hands and my feet. You start with in whatever position you want. Make sure you have the correct form. Back is not arched. Let's get started. Go. It's not press. Okay, here we go. So make sure you're breathing. Your abs are always tight. Squeeze your butt. And this is one of the positions. It's my favorite one, actually. I'm shaking already for some reason. Now, you can also go here to your knees. So if you're in, um, in this position and you're like, oh my gosh, I can't hold it anymore, just drop your knees. And this is another position here. Your shoulder, elbow, wrist are aligned. You can also go down on your elbows here, okay? We have five seconds left. And time. Great job, everyone. Now let's stand up and do our lunges. We have 15 lunges each leg. I do mine in a stationary position. You can do walking lunges. You can do jump lunges if you want. You can um, try to So any other kind of lunge that you like to do. I just like doing these. So... Let's get ready to lunge. In the position, back is flat. You're up straight, abs are tight. Let's go down, up. Squeeze when you go up, come up. And this is two. We're doing 15, three. Make sure your knee does not go over your toe. This is five. Breathe out when you come up. Squeeze your legs, abs when you stand up. This is nine and 10 and 11, squeeze. We're not in a rush, we're always working the muscles hard. Okay, 13, 14, last one, make it good, 15. I'm just turning around, now my other leg is in front. Make sure you're on your toe in the back. Let's get started. Go down. That's one. Again, squeeze when coming up. Two. You should feel this in your butt. Three. Abs tight. Four. Breathe out standing up. Five. Down. Six. Squeeze both butt cheeks when you stand up and your abs. Eight. You're breathing out here. Breathe in, going down. Ten. Five more. Five. Four. Three. If you can't go low, go as low as you can. Two. Do your best. One. That is it for today's challenge. Great job, everyone. Whoop, whoop, whoop. We're done. And remember... To find me on social media, Facebook, 
Chevy Williams on Instagram, LBX Fitness, one word. Twitter and Pinterest, LBX Fitness, two words. Visit my website, www.leadingbyexample.us. Make sure you order my book. It is a great, awesome book. I teach you how to use social media to lose weight for free. Also, if you are a woman age 40 and over, I have something just for you on my website. So check my website out for that. I will see y'all tomorrow for day eight. Bye, everyone. Keep pushing on.